So here we have the Toyota Igo on an 09 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. From the outside though, you can see it's a five door car. We're going to start off inside the boot first of all. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have a 50-50 split folding rear seat for the boot uh, and it's a very deep boot, so actually uh, deceptively large given the size of the car. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back around to the front of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some of the controls on the inside of it from there. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. We have the speedometer, fuel gauge and total miles for the car uh, displayed here. You can see the total miles are 104,645. Above that, we have the rev counter for the car. Over in the center, we then have the stereo. So up here, you can go between your CD player, uh, your auxiliary input, AM and FM radio as well, and you can adjust your volume up and down just there. We have our heated rear screen and our hazard warning lights. Uh, and then the fans, so you can decide where you'd like the air to be distributed once it enters the car. You can adjust the fan speed and the temperature that you'd like inside the car as well. We have a storage tray along with a 12 volt charging socket, two cup holders and a five speed manual gearbox. All that leads me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to give us a call here at Surrey Specialist Cars. We'd love to hear from you soon.